Hi, today I'm going to do a quick little overview of quizzes, which is a alternative learning tool similar to Quizlet or Kahoot that students can use to uh, practice anything that you have for the day. So let's let me go to my activity first. So a little sample quiz I've created is so there's four questions and there's the different kind of questions in here. So let me just go through it real quick. And it plays it like a game. So like the first question I have is what quiz program is this? So it gives you four options. Quizzes is the right answer. And it does stuff like that. It kind of tries to make you laugh while you're doing it. And then I go up in points based on how much I did. Step two is just simply to draw a smile because there is a drawing feature too. So if you want students to draw specific things, they can do that. Um, fifth letter the alphabet. So um, just type in the answer to that. And then you can pick which kind of um, points you want to get in there. And then have you used this program before? This is the polling question. So um, yes, I know how to use it. And then that's all I really have for my answer there. So it's just a short little quiz to demonstrate. Um, what else you can do if you were to create a quiz? You have to give it a name. You can pick a relevant topic. I'm going to go with computers because for the sake of time. And then here's the type of questions you can make. Little toys polling, fill in the blank, open-ended drawing or slides. Um, and in order to get a quiz quality score, you have to add a quiz image, four questions, and you have to be able to grade it. So overall, it is a very useful tool for teachers to use in their classrooms because it is an alternative to what everyone uses, which would be Kahoot. So it's a good change of pace that students can do in the laptop. Um, it adds competition because you can retake it to get better scores, but the questions are always out of order. Um, to learn more about it, you can simply just go to quizzes.com, and there's so many sample quizzes you can take. Um, Google more, and just keep exploring until you find a way to do this program that you enjoy doing. And that is all I have for you. So. Thank you for watching.